Target store. Now, is it downtown Seattle where this rampage occurred? Downtown Seattle. So this uh, Target store, um, anyone who's downtown will kind of know this area. It's on 2nd Avenue. And it's in this area where there's a lot of bus traffic. It's kind of what I would call probably a few of the dirtiest blocks in Seattle. Oh, yeah, that's right by my heroin. <laughs> right, okay, so yeah. Yeah, but it's in this area that's super high traffic. It's right on the street level, and, and it's a multi-level target. Um, it's super busy, and there's a lot of, you know, there's a lot of street activity around there, a lot of transient activity. Um, and it's in this area where there's, like, a lot of really nice shops, too. It's kind of in this, like, kind of dilapidated but also very high-end retail area. Columbia Sportswear is nearby. You know what I'm talking yeah. about? And that's um, where this incident happened. They so wonderfully set up for us. Yeah, so the guy goes into the store, and it's literally a 15-minute rampage. Um, um, he headbutts someone. He pushes other people. He pushes this big bending machine down an escalator. If that had hit someone, that could have killed somebody. Yeah, and at one point, he's he's using a, this giant, um, he's using like a TV monitor to try to smash open a display case full of Apple products, and he just slaps everything on the ground, and he has two giant duffel bags that he had just stolen from the Columbia Sportswear shop down the street, um, and he ended up you know, running out of there and police never got there while he was in the store. 